At first glance, it's a nice brick home where any family might enjoy living, but it's more than that, as two University of Alabama students can tell you. Hi, I'm Quinn Kelly, and this is the House Tuscaloosa. Quinn Kelly and Alexis Cumbie serve on the board of directors of the House of Tuscaloosa. And what we hope to do with our literacy center is give children uh, the basic building blocks to have a successful life and to prolong their life. We understand like never before that literacy isn't just about reading well. Literacy affects every part of our lives. Literacy um, is understanding, not, not just reading, um, but understanding. So um, our focus right now is educational literacy, spiritual literacy, um, and musical literacy, but we hope to expand that to other areas. This quaint brick home here on the campus of Stillman College once served as the home of the president of the school. It's been vacant for almost 20 years, but now it's coming to life again. And the board members of the House Tuscaloosa are not afraid of getting their hands dirty. Uh, Quinn and I and the rest of the board, I mean, we come here almost every single day, uh, multiple times a week to, to paint and to sand things down and to move furniture. And so um, it's been a smaller team because of COVID, but we're just blessed that we've had people work on the outside um, and, and sort of help us uh, really just get the house running. Inside, shelves are already being filled with books, lots of books. Quinn and Alexis are both graduate students at the University of Alabama, and they want the house Tuscaloosa to be a special place. My goal is that we can really connect with, with the teenage population. I think their reading comprehension is so pivotal and they can either sink or swim. They can either decide to go to college um, or go another route. But my hope is that they come here and, and see it as an inviting community space where they can um, not only receive mentorship, but also connect with people throughout the community. It is hoped that operations at the House of Tuscaloosa can begin this summer. Quinn and Alexis and other volunteers are working on fundraising and raising awareness too. Yeah, so you can follow us on Instagram and Facebook at the House Tuscaloosa. Uh, you can also find our website at the same name, the House Tuscaloosa, uh, and learn about our mission, learn about our vision, uh, and learn about what we plan to do and get involved. And you can visit their website at thehousetuscaloosa.org. Of course, ongoing funding is needed, and volunteers are always welcome. These young people and all involved are focused on making literacy and better lives their mission. That's the Spirit of Alabama. Mike Royer, WVUA 23 News.